If you happen to see this trim little buggy zoom up and quickly swing into a tight parking spot, you'll be looking at a remarkable new car, the Davis three-wheeler. With four seated comfortably, it takes off. Streamlined as a plane is this unique creation with designer Gary Davis at the wheel. Built in Southern California, it logically incorporates several aircraft principles, such as adaptation of the tricycle landing gear system. A switch on the dashboard operates built-in hydraulic jacks and makes tire changing an exhilarating experience. The single front wheel explains the car's parking dexterity and keeps it on an even keel in the event of a blowout, even at a top speed of 115 miles an hour. There are no fenders. Wrap-around steel bumpers protect removable body panels. This little chariot can really run you around in circles. What's the trouble, Gary? Uh-oh, a modern Frankenstein. And here's another streamlined marvel on wheels. It only needs a pair of wings to be at home in the sky. Formidable indeed is its nose. With riveted aluminum fuselage, entry hatch, and rugged empennage, it's wasting time on the ground. But being earthbound, the monster is trundled out onto the highway to frighten other motorists. If you're looking for a 1960 model, this may well be it. Somewhat less spectacular is this sporty new creation of Gordon Burig of Pennsylvania, designer of the famous Cord. Front fenders of laminated fiberglass turn with the wheels made of light magnesium. Body and removable top are of aluminum and plastic. In the cockpit, or rather the driver's compartment, Mr. Burig operates the controls, closely resembling those of a plane. Thus, aircraft methods are becoming increasingly popular in automotive science. 